I said, well, I said, I know you worked really, really hard, but I got a phone call today. And they all looked sort of shocked and a little woebegone. And then I said, I have a message. I'll, I'll play it for you. So I hit the message, and, and it said, we're calling to congratulate you on Harker winning the J8 competition. Kinder auf der jährlichen Abschlussfeier für die J8 Kids, wie die Gruppe hier liebevoll genannt wird. Entschuldigung, wo ist die Toilette bitte? Wow, <laughs> it's amazing, it really, it, it's a, such a great opportunity to be involved in um, what your government does and what the world does and to talk to other youth from around the world. As they prepared for a face-to-face -face meeting with the G8 leaders, a group of young people from around the world worked hard to articulate exactly how they would make the world a better place to live. Five years ago, global warming was not a hot topic here. This year, the presidential candidates are talking about it, everybody's talking about it. So it's going to happen, change will happen, and it does take some time for us, more than other countries. I think we learned a lot about the different perspectives that other students have from around the world. It's really interesting to hear what someone from India or China has to say on a lot of the issues. So we also want Harker students to be involved in that. We're starting a Friends Across Borders Club. It was kind of based on what last year's U.S. team created at their school. We're going to be discussing child rights and probably having um, an awareness fair for the community.